Hi, this is Jonathan Rotz, field agronomist with Pioneer, and today I want to take a quick moment and talk with you about wheat, and more specifically, head scab and the application of fungicide to combat that. So in my personal opinion, head scab applications are a must in our high management, high yielding wheat, and they're also one of the trickiest ones. Um, now specifically on a year like this where we have intermittent showers in the forecast and we're going to be soaking those heads as well as some of these hotter temperatures uh, pushing things along, it's a really great time to make sure that we're timing these well. So on a typical head scab application we're going to look for 50 percent flowering. Now wheat's an interesting crop to really pay attention to on flowering. Flowering in wheat we have to pay attention to anthers on the head. So we're thinking about 50% of that head having anthers on it present uh, to get that timing of fungicide. Now I will admit um, with additions of products such as like Marivis Ace and some of our large, longer acting products, uh, those can actually even be applied at 50% heading. I personally still like to look at that primary head and look for 50% uh, anthers or at least pr the presence of anthers on that primary head and then thinking about taking that long uh, residual of those products and utilizing that to uh, give us better control through all of our different tillers including fall and spring. Again, timing is the critical thing so get out there and scout those wheat fields. Remember you're looking for those anthers, the presence of those anthers. Um, some guys will watch forecasts to decide but I would say on high yield, high management wheat, let's just go ahead and make a head scab application. I hope you found this helpful and informative. And uh, if you have any other questions, as always, feel free to reach out to your Pioneer sales rep, myself, or any of the Pioneer employees. And as always, I wish you the best with your Pioneer products this growing season. That concludes this Pioneer Agronomy video podcast. Visit our page on pioneer.com and follow us on Twitter and Facebook for more agronomy insights.